Welcome back. Thanks very much for staying with us. You're watching Beyond World is One with me, Raisha Segal. There's lots lined up on the show, lots to unpack. But first, a quick check on the headlines. Two Indian Army soldiers killed in action in a gun battle with terrorists in Jammu and Kashmir's Kishtwar area. Two other soldiers injured. Another encounter underway in the Baramulla area. U.S. President Joe Biden downplays Vladimir Putin's warnings of war if Ukraine is allowed to fire Western-provided long-range missiles into Russian territory, saying he does not pay much attention to the Russian leader. U.S. military says four ISIS leaders were killed in its raid in western Iraq on August 29th that killed 14 operatives, including the head of the jihadist group's operations in the country. U.S. announces new sanctions against Russian media channel RT accusing it of being a de facto arm of Russia's intelligence apparatus. Total three entities and two individuals connected to Russian campaign sanctioned. I can say this, uh, we will do large deportations from Springfield, Ohio. Large deportation. Donald Trump doubles down on his anti-migrant attacks despite facing criticism for conspiracy theory targeting Haitian immigrants as he and Kamala Harris take the presidential campaigns to swing states. Israeli army shows exposed tunnel shafts in Rafah's Tel El Sultan area that they say were uncovered in southern Gaza, including an underground chamber where bodies of six Israeli hostages were recovered. I'm grateful that, uh, you know, it's played out the way it has. We're here, we're safe. NASA astronauts Sunita Williams and Butch Wilmore called the delay in their return to Earth testing times but feel grateful for spending more time in space.